Hi everyone and welcome back to brand new video on my channel. As you can see today I'm back with a brand new video on Rocket League and today I'm completing my final two placement matches in the drop shot playlist. I'm currently around about plat 3 diamond 1. I don't know exactly what I'm at. I was diamond 1 last season. So yeah let's see what I end up getting. If you guys end up enjoying this video then consider leaving a like and subscribing for more content just like this and let's get straight into it. Okay guys so I'm in my first game we're playing against a full team. Honestly, I don't know what to think about this at the moment because the people I've been playing against have just been not the best. So, it's a bit like it could go either way, to be honest. Honestly, that was a bit risky. He probably should have left that. I'll wait to see where they hit that. Okay, they both went for that. Dumb. The amount of people I see at this rank just both going for it is insane. Like, I swear, literally every single time I've been in a game and I've had two teammates that aren't in a team together, I've literally had them both go for it, like, a lot of the time, like, both double committing. I'm just thinking, does no one actually use their eyes? Like, half the time, you just literally just need to look slightly and you'll clearly see there's someone else going for it. But, you know, people don't actually seem to look. That was very lucky on their part. I honestly thought that would have um, gone off. But, like, it seemed to... It went off on that one. Very annoying. I you know my teammate didn't really help with that at all. Open that up a lot. Again, this is just like every other game i played. I've been at the top of the leaderboard getting loads of damage. And there's just my teammates getting, like, none. Like, all of that damage on their side, bar, like, one little splash... Is me. Like, seriously? Yeah, that's annoying. Honestly, that I couldn't really do much about that because I wanted to try and control it because obviously he's still there. But then, couldn't um, just smack it because I couldn't control it enough at that point. Honestly, probably should have gone for that sooner. It's nice to see my teammates getting some damage. You know, literally the last game, right, I was not happy about this. 1,100 score I had, 80 damage. My teammates had a combined damage of 30 and a combined score of about 400. I was not happy at all in that game. But yeah, that's a goal already and I'm at the top of the leaderboard. You know, pretty good. Doesn't look like we've got really many holes. We've got that one there, which they almost scored in. I think I'll just sit back, wait to see. Didn't see that guy, gonna be honest. But it's a bit like as soon as I saw him, I instantly just backed off. Let him have it. I could see he was going in like full force. You know, just let him have it. But people just don't. They just think, oh no, I'm already going for it. Like, don't care. Like, that's not the attitude. It's literally a team game. Okay, I'm pretty sure that original hit it was actually going in. Okay. So, I think he's going to go for it because he's literally just been following me the entire time. And then he leaves it. Like, why are you leaving it then? I was already on it in the first place. And you went for it then. Why didn't you go for it when I actually was expecting you to go for it? Like, come on, man. That was terrible by me, I'm going to be honest. I mean, that was even worse by him. What the hell was that? I mean, yeah, I missed it, but, like, that is a straightforward hit. How the hell do you miss that? Like, how am I even close to people that can't hit that? Like, seriously? Honestly, it annoys me so much. Like, especially when I've been, like, getting MVP like all of the games I've won I've had MVP by a fair margin and even a lot of the games I've lost I've had MVP it's like oh my god like can you not take that into account when doing your matchmaking because it's like it's just so annoying that was terrible by me I wasn't really paying attention but it does annoy me a bit because I still get matched with all these people that keep placing at the bottom and keep getting carried. It's like, how is that How is that fair for me? If you know what I mean? 
That was terrible. You shouldn't have missed that. I think I got a bit of screen lag for a second. That was very nice by him. Very nice. Honestly, it's nice to see I've got someone decent this time. I am Fex, doing fairly well. That game guy still isn't great. Again, like people like that game guy, he'll be at the bottom of the game most of the games because he'll be getting carried. But he'll still end up being placed in a game with people like me. Okay, that was unfortunate. Not the best kickoff. Okay, it's the I am game guy. Okay, why are you doing that? I was literally about to bang that. Again, he doesn't look. Then I feel like he's probably looking at him. Plat, diamond maybe. No higher than that. There's no way he's champ in normal game modes. I mean, this game mode he's like plat free, so doesn't really say much but yeah it's like it's just simple stuff like that you're not very good at the game you can clearly see you're getting carried or at least you should clearly be able to see that I would if it was me I do generally and I just like lay back if I see them on it I'll be like yeah I'll just leave it I'll see what happens afterwards see if I can get a hit on them I won't just go out of my way to like take the ball off them like so many people especially when I'm playing just don't see that and just think oh I don't care I'm just going for it which is dumb I thought that was a stupid hit by him I'm gonna be honest like you can even just see by his aerials how bad they are like don't get me wrong yes he's hitting the stuff but like you can look at the aerials and clearly see he's not that good at the game. And even then, I was right next to him, in front of him. He's still going for it. Like, man. Don't get me wrong, he's doing alright now, but... You just gotta look at him and you can clearly see, like, he's not the best. Don't get me wrong, in the end, he actually did alright, that was a decent hit. But, the amount of times he's double committing it's not even the fact he's missing stuff i can ignore that it's the double commits that annoy me when i can clearly see that i'm already going for it and they still go for it like i don't know why you would do that people just don't look but yeah let's get into the next game as you can see i'm around plat 3 diamond 1 so yeah let's see what i end up getting okay guys so i'm in the next game and i'm against a full team and i got a season 8 grand champ a oh, season 8 grand champ tournament winner which means they might actually be grand champ oh I'm surprised I hit that I thought I was going to miss it for a second that means this game might be decent might actually have um, decent matchmaking for this one then okay, hit that up hopefully my teammates there honestly that's why I was planning with that one because you're probably wondering like why the hell would he hit that up that's exactly what I was trying to do hit it up because I was expecting a teammate to be there because I could see one had already committed and the other one didn't know where he was so I assumed yeah I was just about to do that as well I assumed he was there that one I mean I couldn't see the guy when I went for it and we both had the same idea just bang that because you don't really want it sort of on the edge of your thing like, yes, you kind of want damage, but at the same time, you don't want them to get damage on you, which seem, people seem to forget. And that's, yeah, literally looking at that, already at the top again. I mean, that last game I wasn't. That was probably the only game I haven't been MVP, but... You know. I'll go for this. Okay. That's another thing. I don't get why two people go for kickoff, because it means that... If two people go for kickoff, you've only got one person to respond to what happens. If only one person goes, you've then got two people to respond to what happens on the kickoff. Which means you're a lot more likely to end up getting damage out of it. I wonder why I did that, is because that guy was going to hit it even more into our side. Which you don't really want to happen. Oh, I can't believe I got that. I honestly did not think that is what would happen there. I was kind of just following, just because. 
Ooh, and there as well. Oh, damn. That was such a good play right there. Wait, I hit that again? Damn. So I have these I shouldn't even be going for. I'm just like full sending it. This one's just working. Like, my teammates aren't going for it either. So it's like, you know, it's not too big of a deal. Oh, I was hoping that would be like a uh, bigger one. Okay, I'll let him go for it. I'll come on to this one. He should have left that. That would have been an even bigger hole. Yeah, honestly, my teammate should have left it. It would have been so much better if he'd have done that. I hate it when it does that, like this game mode. It does that all the time when it sort of like does it as if there's a hole there, like the bounce. Oh, that's not the best. I mean, it got it away, but... I mean, we should win this, just looking at what it's like at the moment. Like, we've opened up a massive hole, we're a goal, in, we're a goal ahead, you know. They would need to score and manage to stop us from scoring. Like, it's very unlikely. Oh, that was terrible. What was I doing there? Okay, nice save. I'll wait to see what happens. Okay, there's two of them on it. I'll, I'll get the next hit. Honestly, I probably should have pushed it before then. Okay, he'll have. Not the best, not going to lie. Just done that. Ooh, that's really awkward. And then that's another goal. Damn. Got 60 damage, more than both my teammates combined. And got two goals as well. Yeah, that was nasty, honestly. And they should forfeit here, to be honest. They didn't? That's actually surprising. Because it's very unlikely with how the game's been going that they are going to manage to do enough damage to get two goals. To get two goals and not be like in a really terrible position, which would make it easy for us to score a third. Oh, that... That, that double tap hit was honestly unexpected, I'm going to be honest. Didn't mean to get that bump then. Yeah, these guys are like a team and everything, which is surprising. That probably means that, that was, there's one guy that's probably the best guy, then there's the middle guy that's alright and it's probably like a friend getting carried sort of thing, I'd imagine, maybe. But then, none of their things are the same, so... It looks like it could potentially be from, from um, like partying up after a game, which I don't know about you, but like I can tell how good my teammates were. And if I saw that bottom guy, I wouldn't want to party up with them, like, even if we won and all that. I cannot believe that they've actually managed to score two goals. Partly was my fault. I did terrible there, but I don't know. How was... is it Alex? How was he so far away? Like, don't get me wrong, I did terrible, that wasn't my fault, but... I'm surprised there wasn't the other guy there as well. So yeah, it's back to all square again. I think it's because I kind of stopped concentrating because I thought the game was in the bag. So... I have to put my concentration head back on. Oh, damn, that's not what I was expecting. Okay, that was nice. Surprised I didn't get a hit there. And they're both double committing, and they both miss. That's the worst one, is when they double commit, and not only double commit, but miss as well. Like, how do you do that? Oh, 
Like, it honestly amazes me how someone can manage to do that. Okay. Not like I was going to try and control that or anything, because now it's right out in the open in the middle. And he was, like, one of the last guys back, so I don't know why he would do that. Honestly, sometimes people just need to use their head. I was going to say, I swear to God, if they score... Oh my god. How the hell did they allow that? Like, I missed it there. Not very much I can do, but there's literally two of them there. How did neither of them get to that? That is unreal. Unreal. But literally though, as soon as I stop, like, proper focusing... Like, as soon as I stop proper focusing and going, like, full tryhard, because I thought it was pretty much game over, like, my teammates can't really do much. It's, like, it's so annoying, like... Like, don't get me wrong, that second goal was completely my fault. But, it's like, my god, man, really? I can't believe we actually lost that. Ended up getting plat 3, div 4. Which, to be honest, if I actually play it anymore, I'll get Diamond 1 without even really having to try, to be honest. But it's like, it's so, that is so annoying. Like, you just look at that, and that's how most of my games have gone. It's, it's actually gone worse than that. And people wonder why I get annoyed about solo queue. Like, literally been MVP every single game apart from that last one. And that last one, I wasn't far off. So it's like, really? So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, leave a like, subscribe, and anything else you'd like to see on Rocket League or any other videos you'd like to see on this channel. And yeah, I'll see you guys all in the next one. Built a empire of stars.